Hello again, Tactical YouTubers. Dub here. Uh, I just wanted to, uh, well, I wanted to show off my Ladybug 3 Salt here a little bit more. Uh, I'm falling in love with it, guys. Um, I wanted to do a couple cut demos. Uh, Big Bubba done some cutting demos a week or so back, and we talked about how, you know, you don't see that many real cutting demos you know we all talk about the knives and the specs and the blade and how great everything is we never really cut through anything with it on camera so I might do some paper but what won't cut through paper I got butter knives that'll cut through paper so I'm gonna do a couple things while it's still got the factory edge and test the factory edge on it and see how well it does sorry about the paper background here I've for some reason this knife against that black background just does not want to focus at all so I had to put a piece of paper down to get it to focus but and as you can see I put a, a Sabenza style uh, lanyard on there just real simple just to give me something extra to grab onto which that's for the review which is a future video anyway uh, let's start with some paper everybody loves paper cutting so I've tried this video before as you can see and I suck at cutting paper through this viewfinder looking straight down uh, I'm not very good so we'll see if I can see like that that was me not the knife and once again me not the knife there we go there we go so the knife is really sharp I just you think as much as I use knives I'd be better at cutting stuff than I am but but it just saws through the paper. So, paper, pass. Good job. Let's clean up the mess a little bit here. You know, I'm still new to this whole looking through the viewfinder, doing it on camera thing. Like, I'll go to grab something and be like two inches away from it. So, that's going to take some getting used to. Alright, let's move on to some cardboard. I know this knife will cut through some cardboard. You run those serrations right along it and it will just, just like butter. Uh, those serrations really help to get through that cardboard. I mean, just, you couldn't ask for anything easier through cardboard. So I'm really happy with that. Pass. Uh, now let's try some uh, paracord, which is something else. You know, I just want to when I get a knife I run through some things that I expect this knife to be able to do for me I expect this knife to be able to you know cut paper open boxes cut string that kind of thing so we got some paracord here I expect it to do pretty well through this paracord it took a little bit of force more than some knives but uh, not bad let's double it up here see what we can do through two It'll cut it well enough. Uh, it isn't the the best at cutting paracord I've ever seen, but it passes. So let's try it, you know. I expect it to be able to open boxes. Well, what do you got to be able to cut to open a box? You got to be able to cut tape. So I just got just a little piece of duct tape here. As you can see, I've already played around with it. Because like I said, I tried this video once before. Let's just see how easy it gets through that duct tape. pretty easy uh, I think for opening a box you know when you open a box it's gonna be just the tip anyway if I could hold on to the what I'm cutting see it goes right through it so I think it's gonna be great for opening boxes and things like that uh, now just one more just for fun let's uh, see what it does against an old aluminum can here wow that was that was a lot easier than I anticipated uh, in fact, it still had Mountain Dew in it. <laughs> I opened, I have two Mountain Dews sitting here. And uh, I happened to pick the one up that I was still drinking. Uh, and not the one that I <laughs> put over here for the test. But, you know, whatever. Uh, so it sawed through that aluminum easier than most knives I've done that test with, that's for sure. So, 
Anyway, this guy is a lot of fun. I just wanted to run it through some stuff, have some fun with it. Uh, I ain't got any other videos to put up tonight. I expected a couple packages today, but didn't get them. Hopefully tomorrow I'll have another unboxing or two. Uh, but look at that. That's horrible. Uh, but anyway, guys, I just wanted to kind of show the knife off a little bit more, do a couple cutting things. Uh, and I think I'm going to start doing that with every knife I get. Just run it through a couple of tests and test the factory edge and see what the knife can do. So anyway, guys, I'll stop boring you now. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, until next time, y'all be careful out there. Arrivederci.